Probably my grandmother who forced me to take piano classes, but I'm so glad she did. I mean, I, I'm not as proficient by any means in piano as I wish I could be, but it certainly opened up my world to the kind of impact that music can have on people. You know, honestly, I think all of my music teachers really had a, a big impact on me because um, there's nothing like music that allows you to escape or put you in a mood or it's such an incredible cultural unifier and I really think music education is so essential for those reasons. You know these days there are fewer and fewer things that kids have in common with each other and the thing about music is it's so universal you know and there's songs that live in your head that remind you of things and it's the kind of thing that whether you read the same books or different books music is, is one of those things that just ties everything together and there are few things that do that these days. Music and sports really. I think it's devastating that music education and the arts are being cut. You know, not everybody is a techno whiz. You know, not everybody is a math genius. And I think that what would this world be like without great artists? You know, with and it, and, it, and it's often those techno whizzes who are inspired by great music. You know, so I think that it's it's an essential component of building one's character. And for those kids who 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 have a prowess in the arts and in music. Um, taking that away would be so detrimental to them. So I hope that, that, that we can continue to encourage music education in schools for sure. Hi, I'm Lisa Ling. Who taught you to play? Nominate your favorite music teacher today.